Welcome. So this week, releasing my article about Intra versus Okta, part one, which covers core capabilities. So what we're going to cover today is looking at how the policies for Intra match up to how the policies are in Okta, just from a user experience perspective as an administrator. Because I said that Okta is much easier, but I want to show why it is. So let's create a new policy. Let's check it out. So we're going to create one for Windows 365. See, I'll go in here and I'm going to select a group. So it goes without saying is that people are, it's a little divisive on this whole tiles thing and how much you like it or don't like it. I'm not a huge fan. Some people like it. I think it's not a great experience. And that kind of ties into some of my feelings on this. Okay, so I selected a few apps in there. So now if we move on to conditions, we're going to, we'll add a few things. So I'm going to go in here and I'm going to pick up, you know, I'll pick a couple platforms. I'm going to pick a location. United States. You know, we're going to, we'll require MFA. And we'll enforce a four hour sign in frequency. You know, just some fun stuff here. I'm going to hit select, off, and we're going to create. So the problem is, are the actual built-in apps from Microsoft, you can't actually look at the policies that are assigned to them. So the actual, so you do is you take off this enterprise application filter, and you have all these different apps in here. And so this one here, I believe, is the actual correct one. Okay, so you can see here, there's nothing that you can actually kind of work with. But if you were to go back and select this other one, which I think I created at some point, in conditional access, you can actually see the policies that were created for it. Uh, but inevitably, that's the issue, right? Is that you can't really, you can create all these policies, but you can't really get good insight to the actual policies you're targeting built in apps. If you select all cloud apps, it'll be in scope. But yeah, but for the most part, the visibility is not great. So let's go see how Okta does it. So we're in Okta, and we're going to look at a product called Active Track. And down the bottom, you go to View Policy Details. So what you'll see here, what's great about what they're doing, is it's all outlaid right on the screen for you. And you can see exactly what is going on, the different rules that are taking place. You can even, say, drag stuff up, however you really want to do it. So it, they do a really, really nice job with that. Now let's actually create a rule so you can see what it's like. So we're going to create this test rule. And we're going to, we'll target our contractor user type. And we'll say if they're part of IT. As you can see, you can do groups. You can do a specific user if you want to. We're not going to do that. You can, see you can do exclusions. You can do registration managed, which is just like the Intune compliance stuff essentially. Insurance policy, which is, you know, basically like compliance policies. You can even say if they're in a specific zone, like like U.S., we'll use U.S. restricted. And make sure they're low risk. Custom expressions are for things like CrowdStrike and the CrowdStrike integration. Then you can allow it. My favorite thing is, is as you select different factor types, it'll show you how you would satisfy those requirements. So when I select possession, it just says I have to verify if I do any two factor types, it, was, it says you can do verify for everything, or you could do password and then verify. You can enforce phishing resistant. You can see that changes the way things are. You can enforce um, touch ID, all that. And so I save and see here, I, I create my new test rule, and then you can kind of drag it around and you see how it works. Then you can even go in and you can deactivate those rules. And this just kind of gives you a really great idea as to when I'm saying how there's a totally different experience, there is truly a totally different experience with Okta. And it's just a better user experience. Capability-wise, they're pretty close. Um, but there's not a, you can't say enough about building a good user experience. Because that ensures, that, one, you don't lock yourself out. And two, that you build policy in a deliberate way exactly how you meant to. Mm -hmm.